Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2021 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to draw and animate a simple line like I have done right here. Let me just show you what it looks like. Nice and easy. There we go. We got a line and it animates out from one point to another point. This is incredibly popular on when people are using video that has maps or things like that on it where you want to show uh, movement. So let me show you how to do it. I'm going to delete everything here and we're going to start from scratch. I'm going to delete even the sequence so you can see it step by step. Okay, the first step here is we've got some footage like you can see here. It's a map footage. I'm going to drag and drop it into the timeline and presto. We've got this map and there we go. So in the next step here is I'm just going to trim it to about four or five seconds just because I just want to keep it nice and short so you don't, it doesn't bog down my CPU. The next step, and this is not a requirement, but I like to do it because I like to work non-destructively. I'm going to create an adjustment layer. So what you need to do is you go to your project panel, click on new item, adjustment layer. If you do not see that new item option because you've got a smaller box here, just drag and drop it out until you see that little new item option. Left click and then left click on adjustment layer to create an adjustment layer. Now I've got a one second adjustment layer. I'm going to drag and drop that onto my timeline. And then I'm just going to make sure that the adjustment layer is the full length of the video. All right, if you're following along, now I'm going to left click on the adjustment layer. And then you're going to see under effect controls, I've got a whole bunch of new things going on here. But what we want to do is we want to go to our toolbar. So this is our toolbar. And then on the toolbar, we have something called the pen tool. Left click on the pen tool and click on somewhere where you want the line to go. So maybe I want the line to go from here and then I want it to go maybe to something like this flag here. I don't know, something like that. I'm going to take a look at that. So I'm just gonna left click again on the selection tool. See what we got. We've got a line, excellent. I'm going to go to the V3 or video three track and make sure that the line is now the same length as the rest of the video, at least for this video. All right, good, uh, hopefully you're following along. Now on the effect controls panel, you'll see shape. And under shape, when I hit that little chevron there, you're going to have some options. So what you want to do here is you want to remove the fill. So if you've got a check mark for fill, left click on it and make sure that it's empty. And then change the stroke. You can change the thickness, as you can see here. So I'm going to change it to about, I'm going to work with about 15. And then you can change the color. So we've got blue and let's say you want a purple line for whatever reason. No problem. Left click. It's purple now. Presto. We're on our way. Now we want to animate it and here's the one final part that you all came to see. What you want to do is making sure you're selected on the shape. You want to go down now to scale. Move your playhead to the beginning and left click on the scale toggle animation switch. I'm going to change that from 100 which means it's 100% there to 0. And then let's say after 2 seconds or so, yeah something like that, 2 seconds. I want it to be 100%. I'm going to now increase the scale to 100%, which is full. And then you're going to see here that we've now animated a line from left to right, which is what we came for. I'm going to hit spacebar and presto. There's your animation. That is all there is to it, guys. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Ton more stuff coming up.